Hey guys, welcome to Aries season, even though we've been here for a while. But that's okay, we're just no scoping this shit real quick, because I'm late with everything. It's just gonna be quick quicks. Quick quick. Quick quick. Was that the dude's name? I can't even remember. I need to read that book again. I need to get my books. So I hope y'all are doing well. This is just an Aries season spread. Very quick though. Much like Aries. This whole... You know, I know it's March, but this whole in like a lion is kicking it a little bit too far. But then again, we're still in the whole Capricorn Pluto phase. Two fucking fish who make no sense are having a conversation. And we're moving into the sign of Aquarius with Saturn, so yeah. Fun times. You know, Capricorn is about government, control, order, and shit like that. And it's just like, and Aries is losing its shit. Aries is losing their shit, but they're learning, and that's the important thing. So, we got the star. Three of Swords. Six of Wands. Ten of Cups, Reverse. Hold up a minute. That's curious. These both can stay here since they were together. Page of Cups with the Nine of Wands, Reverse. Hmm. Well, for Aries season, it's kind of awkward. Some people are finding their strength and some people are not. Some people are ready to give their heart and the other person's ready to possibly just be like, I'm not fucking you. You don't even have the right kind of hole. You got a fish. You're like fucking Capricorn, only stupid or some shit, right? <clears throat> I don't know. But, um... Some people were heartbroken, for sure. A lot of people are facing, like, dilemmas when it comes to, like, a situation from three perspectives, for the most part. Could involve Leo and Aquarius. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Aries, for sure. Sagittarius, you could be in here too. Oh yeah, if this doesn't resonate with you, don't worry about it. You just boop your nose away, guys. No point worrying about shit. They ain't got nothing to do with you. It ain't none of your damn business, so just enjoy the show. Also, don't at me, because I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about. Anyway, but yeah, it's like, um... Mmm. If you're like an airy season, a lot of people are going to have to learn how to, uh... Accept some fate. There's work to be had in the situation over here. Someone might be losing their strength and gaining their energy back one way or another. Or maybe they're trying to heal themselves from lost desires. Egoism. Eating too much. Shit like that, right? The Three of Swords, though, it's like, there's work to be had, but I feel like they're kind of also ignoring what they shouldn't be, you know? It's like they're turning their head away. Feeling justified for doing so, too. And then they, some people might feel like they want to escape. Mind you, we're all locked in the fucking box. We're all locked in the box. There ain't even no socks. Bullshit. You know? Just saying. It's a big, I, I want to make sure we're clear on that. We're trapped in a glass, a wooden box of emotion. Right. So, the Six of Swords over here, it's like a vibe of like, it's not even like, it's like, 
Well, she's asleep, so I feel like people are dreaming of going places, too. The swords are, um, about communication and thoughts and how those thoughts work and logical and rational shit. But it's like someone's dreaming of this. Like, someone's got, like, little halos coming out of their head or whatever. This camera is so shitty. I wish I had my other one. God damn it, it's at the house. Fuck. Ugh, I hate going back there anymore. Let's see. But yeah, it's like a thought of escape or a dream of wanting to escape of sorts, right? Mainly because things probably didn't come out the way that they imagined. Once again, threes. People's got threes in here somewhere. I feel like the three is important. Hmm. These two cups are empty, just like these ones, because the picture's upside down, you know? Like, you can't... I don't give a shit what the cards say. You know, if it's upside down, it's not gonna hold anything, unless it's got a sticker. And you can't put a sticker on water, but water will stick on a sticker. So, I, I mean, well, I guess that kind of works, but it's not the same. And... I feel like someone doesn't... It feels like there's a loss of focus here. with what's in front of them, when it comes to this dreaming of escaping whatever... Um, crash world matrix reality we're in now because oh my god like talk about fucking things up right let's see ten of cups down here I feel like people are really seeing the ugly side of each other because like they were close but then the bitch but the bitch is holding him still and she's breathing halitosis in his face so he suffocates or just passes out so she can rob his ass right all too close to his personal settings kind of holding him there and shit too almost like a seduction thing but now it's like bitch i'm not drunk anymore and your breath stinks back up you know i feel like people are kind of doing that And people are being separated by a third party, but not in, like, the sense of, like, it's one person. There's people all over this board. I mean, like, my, um... Like, my shadow escape, not every picture is of a person. But, it, well, there's a, there's a duck. I mean, it's swan, but whatever. The swan's over here, too. It could be the same fucking swan, but it's, like... I don't feel like this is one person separating two people as much as it is, like, just groups a little bit, I think. Mm. Is this, like, trying to let your guard down? But not really. It's more like paranoia. Because I used to read that, maybe that's what this is. Maybe that's why all these people are here. Um, they're only letting their guard down to go kick some ass. And I feel like this is a potential right here. Like, maybe somebody feels as though they're being challenged. Oof. Definitely. I have to keep my voice down because, like, it's hot here and I want the window open. But at the same time, like, I have neighbors and they're all outside and they keep screaming at their kids and it's like... Your kid sounds like they're two, you know? You sound like you're younger than two with that attitude, but you know. Alright. Page of Cups with this Nine of Wands reverse. Is like people are too caring? Because the Page of Cups is immature. And there are children and people yelling at children. Um, so is somebody being really immature with their whole paranoia? That's the question of the day, kids. Leave your answers in the comments below, please. There'll be a quiz after class. Bring your own pencils. Jeremy, I know you're not going to. I have some pencils for you. Nobody else gets a pencil there because Jeremy can't remember for shit. Uh, the rest of you have no fucking excuse. So bring a pencil. Anyway. Yeah, but I feel like someone's emotions get to them to the point where they're 
way too on the defensive side. Like, you're being paranoid of the whole thing. Just to get a victory. Mm. That's fucking stupid, but okay. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. Don't look at my ass cheeks either, people. Like, I re well, I really don't care. You can look at whatever you want. So I'm sorry if some of you saw something you didn't want to see. Which is my boots, my cheeks. That's backwards. I always feel bad if, if I, like, accidentally see the cards, too. And there's something all over them, which I don't know what that is. But that makes me really sad. I just used these the other day, and they were not like this, actually. They kind of sound like a tool intro or remix or whatever. Okay. Alrighty. So. What happens after this one? Where it feels like, hmm. It's like a healing of what was lost, either strength or healing after falling for vices or, um, not vices, what is that, uh, guilty pleasures or something like that. That's what it kind of feels like a little bit. Yeah, someone might have got fucked up in a trap. Someone might have got fucked up. Or they tripped into the trap. What are the two? I don't know, but it's about working. Third, hairy situation and how it was justified. Like, does someone think that this separation here is justified? Because that's immature as fuck. <laughs> Page of Cups reverse. That's immature as fuck. Um, very weak with it as well. I will say. Because the Page of cups is right here and they're upright but i feel like it's just a guise of caring out of paranoia and it doesn't seem like it washes emotional wise with anybody it doesn't sound as good as it really should be appealing you know six of wands with the five of cups reverse Someone dreams of moving on, but they're hesitant because, I don't know, is it like a situation where, like, what if it ends up the exact same way? Well, it's probably going to, you know. Feeling left out of the cold. Because someone's going, might possibly end up walking away from a situation or somebody else. He's going to end up not caring. And then they're, like, you played yourself, they're going to get a clap back, I feel like. <clears throat> it's like when this person, or these people, or these things, because there's really a lot of fucking people out here, honestly. Um, when all this shit starts to, um... I don't know, like, it's feeling like some people might just feel left out in the cold about the situation other people are gonna walk away but that would be somebody playing themselves and getting thrown off their horse like it's like a mm. well by the positions that would be the woman who gets who walks away she's supposed to be like me this person's walking away and then like but then that means that she's the one on the horse, and this is the dude who pulled her off the horse. She didn't slam. It was like, somebody left, and the other person was like, meh, I don't care. And that was, it was almost like the wrong thing to fucking say. You know, the, 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 the separation, or whatever it is, seems justified, but somebody's fucking it up. When it comes to actually, um, getting the point across of why they think it's justified. But their justifications are also based on some paranoia. And someone's picking up, like, very, very bad breath on another human being, right? I got, oh yeah, this is a laptop I'm buying. It's fucking sweet. It's a Samsung. It's got GE 
Force GTX, which is actually what I had in my bio. Many, many years ago, and that thing is powerful as fuck. It has its own built-in video editor and audio editor. So I'm super duper excited about that. I don't have to buy anything for that shit. I still need to put a lot of my old programs on, but and that's going to take time to find them. I almost thought I had like Windows Open Office, and I didn't. I was excited for nothing. Made me sad. Anyway. Alright, this Ten of Cups with the Nine of Wands both reverse. Someone's losing interest in somebody else, but I don't feel like it's like... Like, it's based in the emotional things, too. Oh god, everyone thinks I'm dying now. That's great. That's fucking great. Don't you come over to my window, Tommy. I'll kick your fucking ass. My neighbor like standing outside my window and screaming shit. And it's just like, are you fucking for real? Like, everybody, everybody likes my attention. And it's just like, ah, uh, whatever. Okay, so let's see. What's up with this? It, 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 like, is somebody losing the interest? The dude or whoever it is that's losing the interest that doesn't like the bitch's breath no more? Is that what's stemming the paranoia? And then they try to keep giving out feelings about why they're justified with their paranoia and having people by their back. Because it's like, makes them feel victorious almost. I feel like this is a clap back for some assholes somewhere. Let me respond back to this guy, cause like, yeah. That way he doesn't come near my window. With some tarot cards. Nosy ass. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Did I drop one? No, I can't remember. Fucking Tommy. Okay. Anyway, let's see we're done now. Well, those were stuck together, so. Um. Not yet, Tommy. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna stop answering for a minute. Okay. Well, these two cards came out. It's like, time will tell the truth. Eventually, someone's going to end up releasing the bird. Or something's going to release the bird. It's just covered for now. It's going to take time. Hmm. I'm not going more. I'm curious as fuck. What's it going to say? What's it going to say? The motherfuckers be, need to be stopped tripping? Is that what? Because that's like way coming out of a drug state or some shit. Time will bring out some truth. Wait, are you having a good. Are some people going to have a good hard look at themselves? So, like, time will reveal what's going to be let out as truth, but the hermit's kind of threw me off. Let me get one more. Ah. I hate kind of having neighbors that want to talk all the time. Like, they're awesome. But, you know, like, someone's holding on to their strength. Some people, right? Some shit needs to be buried, which I don't think is really appropriate at this point in time in history. But something's going to get buried during Aries season. In Aries, it could be you or it could be somebody who you look down to as your loyal, faithful, ram sidekick. 
bitch, or whatever, right? And you're both kind of just chilling. Uh, let's see. Doesn't seem like with all this control, there's a lot of options to be had in the ones that are had. Uh, people are just leaving shit behind, scarcely carrying anything except for swords of other people on their back. And then ending up being dicks to them. Just because they ask for shit. Hmm. So that might be what the hermit's observing. You might be looking... Like, a lot of you could be looking at people and seeing what's really going down after a while. If you don't already. And eventually, like... Eventually someone's gonna shoot the hermit. Or someone's gonna shoot something off after all this stuff. It's gonna happen swiftly. It's gonna happen quickly. And it's kind of aiming up here with this page of cups where the emotions just are expressed terribly. Nine of Wands with the Page of Cups and the Victory. Feeling victorious, somebody is. Because, um, well, their paranoia made them happy, I guess. Here's the Empress. What the fuck does that mean? I mean, like, yeah, tour season is gonna come up here shortly, but you know, well, like they're gonna sit pretty. Oh, that's not gonna work out very well. Like, not at all, actually. Like, she has all her ducks in the row. She looks like she's got all her ducks in the row, but something didn't function the way one would think during the season. Oh. Some people are going to be learning today. Just like they did fuck yesterday with the exact same fucking lesson. This is a repeated in history. The tower's getting hit twice because someone didn't listen. And I feel like they didn't let the bird fly the way it was supposed to be flown. Oof. Every season is rough. So yeah. May the odds of me ever in your goddamn favor, y'all, because I'm not sure how this is a reflection of what's going on there this season and whatnot, but it's like, holy shit. I don't know. I'm going to try to get back into the readings either tomorrow or the next day. I will have time because I'm quarantined for seven days. Like, so that's fun. So we're going to do more readings for a while. going to be a good time, y'all. You'll love it. Anyway. I will see y'all later. I love your face. If you like this video or the reading, you can like, share, subscribe. I promise I'll wear pants next time. Probably not because it's hot in here, but you know. I'll do my best. I will see you guys later. I love your faces. Bye.